you got off lucky, homie. Do my thing for the business, I guess. Great. They're waiting at the entrance to the Richmond Hotel on West Eclipse Boulevard. I'm moving to Vice City. Uh. So, man, uh. I feel like I'm living a paradise. Is this really Get out of here, Chuck. Back home. Okay, we got three stops, bro. Polly here is the closest. Maze Bank, Alta Street. Hey, quick as you can, we're kind of late. As you can see, we're pretty good for a tip. Drunk massage. Ooh, ooh, on the company dime. We're skipping work. Banking, dude, they want you there 24-7. You have to let off a little steam sometimes. No use making all that money if you can't enjoy it. On that note, are you thinking what I'm thinking? Holla! Blaze that bad boy. Yo, are you 420 friendly, bro? Whatever. Oh, yeah. Bail out blunt. It is happening. I am spinning out here, regretting that last plate of oysters. Driver, you want to hit? Nah, man, I'm cold. Smells kind of weak to me. This is prime green, man. <laughs> yeah, this is high end. It's delivered by a guy with a briefcase and shit. I'm good, man. I'll leave it to you professional. Whoa, take it to the dome. <laughs> this is some straight up dank. Will you hurry up with that? Seriously, puff, puff, pass, Polly. Sharing is caring. <coughs> Ah, <laughs> lightweight. <laughs> hey, my baby daughter called. She wants her lungs back. Oh, man, we're nearly there. I hope I can pull it together for this presentation. Good luck, dudes. That driver sucks, by the way. Next stop's Fleece the Bank on Hallwick Avenue. Thanks, bro. Is that the last of the weed? Yeah, afraid so. Man, I'm so relaxed. That Olga gives a serious massage. I still can't believe Polly got the dude. Polly asked for the dude. Deep tissue, no hands. Whatever. Yours looked like she used to be a dude. So, did you end happy? Didn't get a chance. I blew my wad into the towel halfway through. <laughs> you can't need a man's thigh like that. Good times, bro. Oh, God. So don't want to go back to work. 
Thanks, bro. Epic hanging out as always, Darren. Keep it real. Okay, screw going back to work. I need to get some junk food in me. Can you drop me out of 24-7? I think there's one on Innocence Boulevard. You ever been to the Richmond Hotel? It ain't one of my usuals, nah. You should check it out. Killer cocktails, great spa. Can't believe we've only dropped two grand this time. Must be slipping. But if we tipped any more, it would have been awkward. What about those two, huh? Top guys, always a crazy time. Lobster in the sauna, though? Schoolboy error. I think, I think fat girl's vagina. You live and you learn, am I right? I think we nearly did. Thank God. I should be just up ahead. You know when all you're craving is ghetto food? Ah, uh, I mean, uh, no offense. We have cameras, just so you know. Hey, what's up with you, man? What's that? Go to list.
you at, man? Your house is empty. Oh, hey. I had to kind of lay low for a while. Yeah, that nice Mexican we met. Me and T did that job for him, and we fell out. You gotta be joking. I wish I was. So where you at now? <sighs> Desert, out by Alamo Sea. All right, well, I'll hit you if I find anything. Absolutely. Uh, oh, hey, Trevor's got his wife. Trevor's got a wife? No, no, the Mexican's wife. What? <laughs> Shit, I don't know what to say about that one. Nothing. Nothing to say about that. Run! Run! I'm back! Tommy Trevor! Uh, bring me my coffee, I'm gonna cut your arm off. Absolutely! Who the hell's that, your maid? Oh, business partner, good guy, very loyal. Ron, Ron, that is Michael. And this is Patricia. <laughs> uh, listen, beautiful. You know, I'm sorry about everything that's happened, and that, you know, I can't guarantee no harm's gonna come to you. I might have to chop you up into little pieces before spraying your pulp mess down the drain, but I really hope it doesn't come to that. I appreciate your honesty. You are a good man. I can see that. You need your eyes examined, then. Ron, you miss me? Yeah, Trevor, a bit, I mean. How's the fucking business? <sighs> I, I tried. If you're gonna give me a sob story, I'm gonna rip your fucking throat out and shove a turd down the hole. It's not a sob story. It's just not quite come good yet. But I heard about something to do with Merriweather. Mm, those assholes. Big yeah. cache of weapons they got coming in. So I thought you might want to uh, requisition it. Fantastic. Let's go. I'm in. Whoa, no, 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 not you. Sit down. You're a wanted man. Stay low. Now watch her, okay? She's a good lady. Let's go, Ron. Good to meet you, Michael. Fucking come on, let's go. <sighs> the weapons are coming in by air. We've got a plane over at the airstrip. But... Great, let's go. What are you going to do? We're not. Gonna take out a private army on the ground, Ron. We gotta meet him in the air. I, uh, okay. Well, look, I knew that you were pissed after the Merriweather heist, giving back the hardware. That was bullshit. Right, right. Look, look out! out! Fucking asshole! So I've been monitoring chatter, tapping into Merriweather networks. Feels good to be back in the company of a professional. I gotta say, I got it. Now, I was expecting something a little more impressive. The late, great Michael Townley. Not so late and not so great, right? And no longer called Townley. The years have not been terribly kind. What's the end game, man? We had a good thing going without him. If it's such a good thing... Where's my money, huh? Where's my consultant's fee and my big fat dividend? I want a franchise network, Ron. I want reward cards and merchandise. I want to make gun violence and drug dependency accessible to every man and beast from Hove Beach to Vespucci. I want country clubs and a depressed wife with blonde hair and a hot little secretary who bounces on my boy. There's Oscar's business. That's bringing cash in. My stake in Oscar's thing ain't under the TP conglomerate umbrella. I want my own brand success. It takes time. Time and money. Sure. And Michael Townley, the Santa, the fuckface, is gonna give that to me. Idiot! Crop duster? That's the best we can do? Get in 
in touch with my Mexican contact. Tell him we got some guns to sell. I'll get you on the CV! Thanks. 